KP classes dedicated to excellence. For gate architecture and planning, there are three parts which you will be having in the question paper. The first one will be for everyone. It is compulsory for everyone to attempt. All the students who are writing this, who are attempting the gate examination can access or should answer this part that is general aptitude. General aptitude will have a total of 20, 10 questions and if you look into past 5 years or even before that, always general aptitude has been a part with only multiple choice questions. There were no NAT, numerical answer type questions or multiple select questions. I hope you are aware with this. There are three types of questions in gate question paper that is multiple choice question where four options will be given and one answer will be correct multiple select question where four options will be given and either one one option can be correct two can be correct or three can be correct or all the four options can be correct remember even in multiple select questions there is a possibility of having only one correct option one correct answer that has been already happened in the past papers also so multiple select doesn't mean you have to select multiple options there can be one option also correct that is multiple select question and then you have numerical answer type questions where you will not have any options you need to type in your value as an answer into the question so these are the three types of questions in the gate question paper always so this multiple select question was introduced just in the year 2021 not before that and remember about negative marking only multiple choice questions have negative marking the remaining two types have no negative marking if you have a wrong attempt so that's a brief idea on the on the types of questions so general aptitude 10 questions always have been of multiple uh, choice type only that is uh, they will be having all the 10 questions will be having negative marking so 10 questions will give you a total weightage of uh, 15 marks. So that's about the first part. That's general aptitude. Uh, so the all these 15 marks will be having will be carrying a burden of negative marking if you have an incorrect answer. Coming to the common part again, this is for everyone who attempts gate architecture and planning question paper. Part A, that is common part. This will be having a total of 39 questions. And from these 39 questions, uh, uh, the, the, all these to so these 39 questions will be a combination of numerical questions, multiple choice questions and multiple select questions as far as the distribution marks, distribution analysis, how many questions with negative marking, how many numericals, we will do this complete analysis in the next part after the syllabus. So first 39, uh, remember that there are 39 questions which you need to answer in the common part and the total weightage carried by the common part is a maximum weightage of 60 marks. So that's the part with the maximum weightage in the gate question paper. You have to have a special emphasis on the subjects of the common part to score well or to get, get a good rank in the gate examination. Part B finally, you will be having two options. Now this is where you will have a choice. You can either select part B1 that is architecture part or you can select part B2 that is planning part. Now which part to select, what should be your strategy regarding selection of part. We will discuss that towards the end uh, within this video uh, in, in this introductory video itself. But before that, let me tell you that there will be two parts and you can select any one of these parts. You can view as of now the question paper structure, how it is in gate architecture and planning. You need not tell which part you will attend while applying for the examination. So in the application portal of gate, you need not tell. You can take the decision of selecting which part to answer during the examination itself. You can tick any one. You will have both the options, both the question papers. You can select any one, either architecture or planning and answer the questions. However, as far as the question paper structure is considered, there will be a total of 16 questions which you need to answer, which will be a combination of one mark questions and two mark questions. And it will be a combination of multiple choice, multiple select and numerical type. All the three types of questions of both one and two marks weightage will be asked in both part A and part B and in part B uh, these 16 questions will give you a total weightage of 25 marks. So that's about the question paper structure and the marks distribution. You can say 60 marks is the maximum weightage of the common part, 25 marks for the part B that is architecture or planning, 15 marks for general aptitude. So the total weightage of the gate examination it will be an exam for 100 marks. So it's an exam for 100 marks. Uh, even if you look into gate architecture, generally the first tankers have scored something around 75 to 80. So 2020, gate 2023 first tankers scored a mark around 75. Gate 2022 the first tankers scored a mark around 80, 79.67. So it is generally in that range. Even if I talk about first tanker, even the first tankers do not score 
above 90 in gate architecture at least in the past recent past so 100 marks examination what should you target first for any competitive examination it is very crucial to set a target now uh, based on the marks the rank may change sometimes with the 60 mark you will have a good rank sometimes with 60 marks you might not have such a good rank so that might change but it is always advisable to set a target above 70 uh, marks above 70 if you're scoring you can for sure get a double digit rank on that uh, very easily and most often you can also get a single digit rank with marks above 70 so set a target if you're preparing with dedication set a target of 70 plus and go accordingly so that's about the question paper structure for gate architecture and planning so be aware of this distribution into common part architecture and planning part and general aptitude